return from the practical physics viewpoint. Once it's happened, what is normally called the Big Bang is not actually the big, uh, the, 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 that instant creation. We know what happened from fractions of a second after the Big Bang on. We know everything that happened after that. And you can just say there is going to be an uncertainty principle in cosmology just as there's an uncertainty principle in, in, in microphysics. You can follow things back and we are always going to be uncertain. We can make all sorts of sophisticated guesses but we're always going to be uncertain at a certain point because the physics is never going to be tied down in experiments. It's always going to be hypothetical physics which may or may not be true. And that half second, as small as it is in it's, units of time, is extraordinarily mysterious and significant yeah. to all of these questions. Yeah. But, but well, what I would like to just focus on, the uncertainty at the quantum level can get amplified to big scales. And I'd like to give you two examples. One is, supposing we knew everything about life on Earth four billion years ago, we couldn't predict life today for the following reason. Life has been affected by cosmic rays which have affected the DNA. The emission of a cosmic ray is a quantum process, and if you have that excited atom, you cannot predict when it will emit and in which direction it will emit. So if you knew everything about the universe four billion years ago, you couldn't predict that giraffes and people would exist today because uncertain events have changed the evolutionary history of the Earth, and so the, the process is indeterministic. Now, so you might say, okay, does that happen on bigger scales? It's happened in the creation of galaxies. At the very, very early part of the universe, there were quantum fluctuations which created perturbations which grew into clusters of galaxies, galaxies, stars, planets, and the Earth. You cannot predict even in principle that the Earth will exist if you knew everything about the Earth uh, everything about the universe at the start of the inflationary era because these quantum fluctuations were unpredictable even in principle. I mean, I, maybe.